What is up, Oddity Acres family? Welcome back. It's been a while. Uh, I missed you guys. Did you miss me? I uh, am excited to be getting out there and hitting another vlog up for you guys. Today is a very special one, something very cool. So I got an extra uh, liquid death today. So we got that taken care of. Um, we are going down to the Ohio State Reformatory and we are checking out the Paris Icon. So um, I hope you guys are ready for a fun one because this will be very interesting. Who doesn't love spooky booths in a haunted prison? Everybody loves that. So that's why we are going. So I will see you down there. We are headed to Mansfield, Ohio. I'll catch you when you guys get there. Peace. <laughs> Right, spooky people we made it to the mansfield reformatory now i've been here before on this vlog um, but it was actually one of my first vlogs that we did um and i actually narrated right over the top of it because i, I ended up not filming any good footage so it's kind of like a, uh, a rebound on that a little bit of a, a second chance if you will and also um you know we're checking out obviously the paris icon so um i'm really excited that we've already pulled in here it's pretty crazy packed right now um there is some really cool food vendors over here. We actually saw the Ghostbusters cars, so we're gonna go and check it all out, and I'm inviting you to join us. See you in there. We got the Ecto-1 here, which is awesome. Any Ghostbuster fans out there? We got the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. Check these out. All right, so we made it in. You can already tell because the bars are behind me. We are officially in the jail. Check this out. This is the vendor room. This is the top upstairs vendor room. So we're going to check it out. And they actually got a little scavenger hunt going on, which is pretty cool. So we're going to check it out. Right, so we are at the first booth, Nature's Earthware. Check this cool stuff out. Wow. Got some awesome t-shirts and keychains, different water bottles.
So a lot of this upper floor area is like homemade stuff, um, you know, stuff that people have made of the crafts and whatnot. So um, this is actually a really cool area if you're looking for something in particular. I'm trying to make sure I include everybody's um, websites and their cards on there as well so you guys can check it out if you guys are interested. Got all the bumper stickers and the ghosts. They even have a Yeti, which is cool. I want the one There you go, this is right up my alley, right here. Got the monster mask, got Tar Man up there. Anyone see Tar Man? Well, I'll let you go, I'll talk to you later. I'll be back here. Too cool. All right, go for it. Hey, I'm Jeff Hartz with the Cleveland Haunt Club. Uh, we're a group that meets monthly in Avon Lake. We're everything Halloween, haunted houses, and horror. So if you check us out on Cleveland Haunt Club on Facebook or go to clevelandhauntclub.com, you can see what we're up to. We're always having some sort of spooky fun. All right, we're moving right along to the next room. Check this out. Wow. So Jeff does all sorts of events. Um, he actually gave me this poster, which is pretty cool. Um, and he does events all around that Northeast Cleveland area. So um, I'm definitely gonna be at one of these. So if you guys are in the area, you guys wanna check out the garage sale, check out other events that are going on, um, you'll definitely run into me there doing a vlog. So um, I invite you guys to come out and just kind of check out the community and hang out and meet new people and see new things. So uh, he told me some very special um, information about what might be going on and somebody very special might be here. I'm not gonna give any hints away, but um, as I said, Make sure if you got some time coming out, check it out. It's gonna be a good time. All of the equipment here, which is really cool, it is filled with different uh, people that are doing podcasts and ghost hunters, people that are selling their stuff. Too cool. We got Adam Berry from Kindred Spirits here, which is pretty awesome. A little bit of a meet and greet going on. Got a long line for Adam. Too cool, too cool. Got the celebrities out, you know? Hey guys, it's John from uh, Seaboss Paranormal. I'm one of the former owners of Prospect Place Mansion in Trinway, Ohio. Uh, we just started our own podcast as well, the Seaboss Paranormal Paracast. You can check us out on www.seabusparanormal.com, all the social media pages, and uh, this next month episode, we're going to start getting into the history of Prospect Place. So if it's something that you've heard about or you're interested in, or even uh, learning some of the misinformation that was reported on television over the years, Definitely check it out and give us a listen. Uh, thanks, guys. Check these dolls out. Holy cow. Look how spooky. If you guys are interested, check it out. If you want a spooky doll of your own. And that is me. <laughs> what else is really cool about this whole convention is that not only are you checking out the vendors and you're seeing all the homemade stuff, and the crafts and all these really interesting things, but you're walking through the prison. You're walking, I know I, I know that I've been here before and then, you know, I know a lot of you guys have been here before as well, but I mean, for the people that haven't, to be able to check out these rooms and the cells and, you know, all of that going on, it's, it's a huge plus. Oh.
So for those of you that don't know, uh, they actually filmed various movies here, including the Shawshank Redemption, which is really cool. And they have a lot of the um, photos from them and um, some of the original props are still here, which is really cool. Um, they also filmed Air Force One uh, with Harrison Ford, so that's pretty cool as well. How's it going? Good, how are you? I'm always drawn in by the proton pack. I have to, I have to come check it out. The, the proton pack is not one of our raffle prizes. <laughs> Darn, because that's all I wanted. It's All right, so we are walking into the West cell block right now. This is the world's largest freestanding cell block as well, which is kind of a cool tidbit, but check this out. How cool is this? Um, I'm Brandy. This is Brandios Glitches. Um, you can find me on Facebook. That's my primary spot is Facebook. Um, just look me up, Brandios Glitches. Um, and yeah, I work with polymer clay and resin and I have no life. <laughs> <laughs> Well, this is absolutely gorgeous though. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure I'm going to link it in the bottom of the screen and then I'll also link it in the description as well. That way they can check it out and they can come buy your awesome stuff. That is phenomenal. So thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All these cool different mugs. Check it out if you guys are looking to step up your coffee game. <laughs> check them out. They got tons of cool mugs and travelers. Looks like we just missed Ben Hansen. You'll be back by three, too. Three also? Okay. So tons of cool celebrities here, which is awesome. All signing autographs, hanging out. So right here is Andrea Perrin. And if you're familiar with Andrea Perrin, she is one of the girls that lived in the Conjuring House. Pretty crazy. Absolutely crazy. I might have to meet her. It never, it never gets old. It's so strange when you walk into a place like that. I mean, the history of what, what went on in there. You know, it's, it's absolutely incredible. You can feel it in your stomach. You know, it doesn't matter who you are. Being behind these bars here is no life to live. Look at this guy. What's up, man? <laughs> What's happening? Not too much, man. Doing the, doing the thing. Yeah. Doing? doing real well. Doing real well. That's it. I'm all over the place. Still doing well, huh? We have uh, we have our second game now. Oh wow! Okay. We did not have it in Marietta, so this is Speed Kills. It okay. just came off of a Kickstarter about three weeks ago. Okay. Uh, fully funded, 420 percent. They unlocked two expansions: the Here Comes the Popo and the Gather the Flock expansions. Okay. So this game. One to uh, four players, less than 30 minutes. Uh, cross between Disney Villainous and Exploding Kittens. Okay, I love Except it. Except with serial killers. That's right, of course. Absolutely. Of course. I mean, it is my brand. That's what we do. <laughs> That's right. But the Here Comes a Popo, you okay. get to play as one of ten police hunting the serial killers. Oh, that's cool. And then the Gather the Flock expansion, you play as one of eleven religions. Okay. Gathering your flock before somebody draws the Armageddon card. And then it's whoever has the biggest religion wins. 
Wow. Yeah, so uh, my favorite is the Saintness. And uh, if the the messed up card for the Saintness is called Jesus Appears. Okay. And if Jesus appears, you lose half of the Saintness following, okay. and they all go to the Catholics. <laughs> it's fantastic. I love it. I love it. I'm going to relink you, too, so they can recheck you out if they have yes. any. Yes. That's perfect. It's always good to see you, brother. Absolutely, man. Always good to yeah, see you. Yeah, absolutely. We'll see you real soon. Cool, man. So we got Dave Schrader here from the Holzer Files. Huge show, which is pretty cool. And right next to him, we got the Ghost Brothers, who I love. <laughs> the Ghost Brothers. If you guys haven't checked out their show, you totally have to because it is so much fun. These guys are awesome. So this is super cool because, you know, you've got all the vendors in here and you've got these celebrities from the ghost shows um, taking time to take pictures and answer questions and all that cool stuff. So that is really interesting. And in the midst of everything, you are standing right here in the cell block, which is really, really cool. Really amazing. Let me check this out. The history here, the people that were in here, you know, it's it's a heavy feeling, absolutely heavy feeling. I've been to a lot of really crazy places, and behind these cell walls, a lot of the times take the cake. All right, so right now, uh, part of the tour, as I said, was going through the jail cells and the prisons. We're in solitary confinement right now, which is said to be one of the most active locations in the entire building. Um, this is absolutely insane. Check it out. He's already gone. There's some in there. I'm serious. Yeah. The one that she's in, that's where the aggressive guy is, he hates her. Wasn't here? That one. Yeah. <laughs> But sometimes you'll be in a room and you'll be talking and you'll just know someone's behind you and you'll turn around and look and there's no one there. And I said, it's just kind of normal here. And as soon as I said that, I felt a finger run down my face. And I was like, all right, you guys ready to go back upstairs? Like, I can't. He took his keys, he let three other inmates out, and they um, actually him and he ended up dying in the hospital three days later oh, yeah. so that was under the staircase so we always say it breaks here for sure oh, yeah. so it's very That's a story that I took yeah yeah it's very a trusty expected and alerted prison officials what was going on what is he saying oh, what's going on yeah not like this he said not like this this is about was taking pictures she said i had what was that in her body I was just curious, say that. I said that, that Caitlin was taking pictures of me and some came from me. And what did I just say? So the story she was telling was right here under the steps is where that guard was beaten to death. Pretty crazy. Standing in this cell in solitary confinement by myself, and it's, you know, I talk about being able to feel somebody eerie and feel something. You know, that you're not, you're not just standing here alone. And even if that's just you're standing with part of history, you know, whatever you tend to believe is, is kind of what, you know, each, to each their own. But this is absolutely incredible to be here. This is just, I can't say enough about how incredible this is. I mean, walking down this, the world's largest freestanding cell block, it's, it's insane. I mean, check this out. Look how far it goes. This is incredible. This is just so incredibly cool. So incredibly cool.
Check this out, the shower room. I can't get enough of like showing inside all of these cells. If you ever are in the area or you live around here, this is something you absolutely have to check out. Like there is no excuse not to. It's incredible. To add to the spookiness and the eeriness of this entire convention, it's starting to pour outside. And not only is it starting to pour outside, we're getting severe thunderstorm warnings. So it's very dark and ominous and gloomy and spooky. And that means that it is the best kind of day, so. It is incredibly perfect right now for a paranormal convention. Because half these lights are out due to the storm. And water is leaking in throughout everywhere. So Ghost Sense USA is a paranormal event company. We have 75 locations, all of them haunted across the United States. We invite our guests to our locations and we start off in a group of 15. We use our equipment, we investigate with that group, and then after we investigate in groups, we lend you our equipment and send you off on your own so you can do your own investigating until 5 a.m. Wow, that is awesome. Lots of fun. So how many places do you see that all around the, the country? 75 across the country. Wow, yes. wow, that is incredible. So if they want to get a hold of you, where would the best place to be? The Facebook? Uh, Facebook okay. or on Instagram, ghosthuntsusa.com. You got it. They can find us there too. Perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. So we are wrapping up the vlog today. I'm in the warden's dining room. Um, I wanted to say too that I got, uh, before I left, had to make a quick pit stop and talk to Andrea Perrin, uh, the girl from the Conjuring movies. Um, she was, of course, was a little girl when it was all going on. Um, but the first movie that everybody's seen is what it was based on. So I wanted to take a moment to uh, check that out and say hello to her. But in the meantime, thank you guys so much for checking out another episode of Audi Acres. We will see you next time.